Which particles surround the nucleus of a neon atom? The answer is one, electrons. The nucleus is made up of protons and neutrons, and around the nucleus are electrons. Which conclusion was proposed as a result of an experiment during which some alpha particles were deflected while passing through a thin sheet of gold foil? The answer is two. Atoms have small, dense, positive nuclei. An alpha particle has a positive charge and like charges repel. So since the alpha particle was deflected from the nucleus, the nucleus would also have a positive charge. The mass of each proton and each neutron is approximately equal to, the answer is 3, 1 u. A proton and neutron weigh one atomic mass unit each. Which statement describes the relationship between two electrons and an atom of magnesium in the ground state? The answer is 4. An electron in the third shell has a greater amount of energy than an electron in the second shell. As the electrons move further away from the nucleus, they have more energy. As an atom in the ground state changes to an atom in the excited state, the atom will absorb energy. As it absorbs energy, it will collide with the nearby particle. Which statement describes the chemical property of copper? Answers 1, 2, and 4 all describe physical properties. The clue word reacts in answer choice 3, hence that answer choice 3 will be the correct answer. At STP, two forms of solid carbon, diamond and graphite, have different properties because if two elements have different structural formulas, they will have different chemical properties. This is the same as answer choice 4. Diamond has a different crystal structure than graphite. Which element in period 2 has the highest first ionization energy? Neon, answer choice 3, will have the greatest ionization energy. Ionization energy increases as you move toward the right on the periodic table. Due to an increase in nuclear charge, the valence electrons become closer to the nucleus. Which phrase describes a specific compound? The answer is three. It's composed of elements chemically combined in a definite ratio. A compound will always have fixed proportions. Which type of chemical formula shows the arrangement of the atoms in a molecule? Four, the structural formula will show the arrangement of atoms in a molecule. The empirical formula is a simplified version of the molecular formula, which shows the proportion of the elements, and the general formula represents the composition of any member of an entire class of compounds. A 2.5 liter sample of SO2 at STP and a 2.5 liter sample of CO2 at STP can be differentiated by comparing their one masses. At STP, both will have the same temperature. It says that both of the samples are gases and that they are each 2.5 liters, which means that they will have equal volumes. Which terms identify the two different major categories of compounds? You just have to remember that the two categories are ionic and molecular, answer choice three. Which molecule of an element contains a multiple covalent bond? If a single bond between the two elements does not give them each eight electrons to complete their outer shell, except hydrogen, then a multiple covalent bond is present. Bromine and fluorine have seven electrons in their outer shell. When a single bond is placed between the two elements of fluorine or bromine, each element will have another six electrons around them, giving them each eight, completing the outer shell. Oxygen has six electrons in its outer shell. When two elements of oxygen have a single pair between them, each element will have another five electrons around them, which will give them each seven, not eight. Which molecule is symmetrical in both shape and distribution of charge? CH4 is symmetrical in distribution and charge. HCl is not symmetrical because the elements are not the same. H2O is not symmetrical because there is a dipole from the positive charge on the hydrogen element and the negative charge on the oxygen element. And H3 is not symmetrical because there are three hydrogen elements. What occurs when two atoms of bromine react to form a molecule of bromine? You can use the acronym BARF to remember that as a bond is broken, energy is absorbed, and as a bond is formed, energy is released. This eliminates answer choice 1 and 4 because they do not match the acronym. If two elements of bromine combine to form a bromine compound, then a bond is formed and energy is released. Answer choice 3. Atoms of which element have the strongest attraction for electrons and a chemical bond? Fluorine will have the greatest attraction for elements in a chemical bond because it has seven electrons in its outer shell, 
so it wants one more electron to complete its outer shell. Heat flows from an object at a temperature of 20 degrees Celsius to an object of temperature 1, 15 degrees Celsius. Heat flows from objects of a higher temperature to objects of a lower temperature. All the other choices have higher temperatures than 20 degrees Celsius. According to the kinetic molecular theory, an ideal gas has particles with three, no attractive forces. You just have to remember the characteristics of ideal gases. Which sample at STP contains the same number of atoms as two liters of HE at STP? The answer is two, because there will be two liters of argon, which is the same volume as two liters of helium in the question. All chemical systems at equilibrium have equal three rates of forward and reverse reactions. You just have to remember that all chemical reactions at equilibrium will have equal rates of the forward and reverse reactions. Which expression represents the heat of reaction for a chemical change? The answer is two. The PE of the products minus the PE of the reactants. Because you're trying to find the heat of reaction for the entire chemical equation, so it makes sense to see the heat of reaction or potential energy for the difference between the products and the reactant. Which phase change represents an increase in entropy? The answer is one, liquid to gas. Entropy increases as matter changes from solid to liquid and then liquid to gas, with gas having the greatest entropy or disorder. This entropy is represented by the random motion of particles. Systems in nature tend to go toward, the answer is two, lower energy and greater disorder. An example that I remember very vividly is that when you come home from school, you will have less energy and your room will probably never be clean, which represents the lower energy and greater disorder that is often present in nature. Which name represents a hydrocarbon? A hydrocarbon is only made up of carbon and hydrogen. One is the only compound made up of these two elements. Which process occurs at the anode in an electrolytic cell? The answer is three. Oxidation will occur at the anode. You can remember red cat and ox, which means that at the cathode, reduction will occur, and at the anode, oxidation will occur. The anode is the source of electrons, and the anode is the, so is the negative terminal. Which formula represents an electrolyte? Acids and bases are electrolytes, so you have to turn to table K and L on the reference table to see which answer choice is an acid or a base. Answer choice 3 is an acid. Which formula represents an Arrhenius base? You have to turn to table K on the reference table to see which answer choice appears. Answer choice 1 is an Arrhenius base. According to one acid-base theory, an acid is a substance that 2 donates hydrogen ions. You just have to remember that an acid donates a hydrogen ion and a base will accept the hydrogen ion. Which nuclear emission has the greatest mass and ionizing power? You can look at table O on the periodic table and you will see that an alpha particle has a mass of 4U, while a beta particle, gamma radiation, and a positron have a mass of 0U. Which statement describes the benefit of the nuclear reaction that occurs in a nuclear power plant? Only answer choice 4 is the benefit among these options. You would not want to use large quantities of water to cool the reactor. Dating geological formations isn't a bad thing, but it's not a benefit either. And finally, you would not want the isotopes to have to be stored for a long time. It poses a risk for people who live nearby. Which elements are present in the mixture? In order to determine which elements are present in the mixture, you should look at the lines of the bright line spectra and align it with those present in the mixture. Looking at these elements, you can determine that elements E and G are present in the mixture. Answer choice three. Which particle model diagram represents a noble gas at STP? The answer is choice two because it shows single elements. Answers 3 and 4 represent compounds that answer 1 shows diatomic elements. A student determines the density of a copper sample at room temperature to be 9.46 grams per centimeters cubed. Based on table S, what is a student's percent error in determining the density of copper? 
Look at the back page of the reference table. The formula for percent error is the measured value minus the accepted value divided by the accepted value times 100. In this problem, the measured value is 9.46 grams per centimeters cubed, and the accepted value is 8.96 grams per centimeters cubed. The problem should be set up as 9.46 minus 8.96 divided by 8.96 times 100. The answer is 5.58%, which rounds to 5.6%. What is the gram formula mass of MgNO32? In order to determine the gram formula mass, you should look at the periodic table to see the atomic mass of each element in the upper left-hand corner. Then multiply this mass by the number of atoms of the element in the compound. Mg has an atomic mass of 24u. N has an atomic mass of 14u, but there are two n atoms, so that's 28u. O has an atomic mass of 16u, but there are six atoms of O, so that is 96u. 96 plus 28 plus 24 is equal to 148 grams per mole, which is answer choice three. Compared to a rubidium atom, a rubidium ion has, just by looking at the choices, you should eliminate answers two and three because they don't make sense. If the ion has one more electron, it would have a larger radius. And if it had one less electron, it would have a smaller radius. Looking at the periodic table, rubidium is in group 1 and has one electron in its outer shell. That means that if it has a charge of plus 1, it will have lost an electron and will have a smaller radius. Which ion in the ground state has the same electron configuration as an atom of neon in the ground state? Look at the periodic table. In the ground state, neon has an electron configuration of 28. K plus will have an electron configuration of 288, so the answer is not 1. Li plus will have an electron configuration of 2, so the answer is not 2. F minus would have an electron configuration of 2, 8, so the answer is 3. Which substance cannot be broken down by a chemical change? The answer is choice 1 because barium is an element. All the other answer choices are compounds, which means that they can be broken up by a chemical change. The difference in which property allows the separation of a sample of water and sand by using filter paper and a funnel? The answer is choice three. Filtration can allow a liquid to be separated from a solid due to a difference in particle size. According to table F, which compound has a very low solubility in water? If you look at carbon on table F, it says that it is insoluble unless combined with group one ions or ammonium which means that sodium carbonate, choice one, will be soluble in water because sodium Na is in group one. The table also says that sulfide is insoluble unless combined with group one ions or ammonium, so sodium sulfide is also soluble. The table says that hydroxide is insoluble unless combined with group one ions, calcium ion, barium ion, strontium ion, or ammonium. This means that calcium hydroxide will be soluble in water because when combined with a calcium ion, hydroxide is soluble. The table says that phosphate is insoluble unless combined with group 1 ions or ammonium, so calcium phosphate is insoluble because calcium is in group 2. What is the molarity of an NaOH solution containing 0.125 mole of NaOH in 0.2 liters of water? Look at the back page of the reference table. It says that the equation for molarity is moles of solute divided by liters of solution. 0.125L divided by 0.2L is equal to 0.625M, choice 3. Compared to a 0.1M aqueous NaNO3 solution at 1 atmosphere, a 1M aqueous NaNO3 solution at 1 atmosphere has a The higher the total concentration will result in a lower freezing point and a higher boiling point. 1M is a greater concentration than 0.1M. So the answer will be choice two, a lower freezing point and a higher boiling point. What is the temperature in degrees Celsius of a sample of matter at 35 K? The back of the reference table has the equation for temperature. K is equal to degrees Celsius plus 273. So we can set it up as 35 K is equal to C plus 273. 35 minus 273 is equal to negative 238 C. Answer choice one. Which graph represents the relationship between pressure and volume for an ideal gas at constant temperature? The answer is choice four. You just have to remember that for an ideal gas, there is greater pressure and less volume. 
Which equation represents a physical change? The answer is choice three, because on the reactive side of the equation, I2 is a solid, but on the product side, it's a gas. All the other answer choices show chemical reactions as elements are combined. Which combination of reactants would result in the fastest reaction rate? The answers with a strip should be eliminated because the powdered substances will have a greater surface area because it's multiple pieces of metal. Between answers 3 and 4, the answer is 4 because 2m of HCl is a greater concentration than 0.2m of HCl. Which equation represents a redox reaction? In a redox reaction, electrons are transferred. The answer is 3 because the electrons can be seen as being transferred since on the reactant side of the equation, oxygen has a subscript of 2, but on the product side it has a subscript of 3, symbolizing that electrons were transferred and that it could be modeled through the crisscross diagram. Which equation represents reduction half reaction? In a reduction reaction, the atom will gain electrons, so the answer will be either 2 or 4. An Na atom has an electron configuration of 281 while an Na ion has an electron configuration of 2,8. When the Na ion gains an electron, it will have the electron configuration of an Na atom, making the answer choice 4. The pH value of a solution is changed from 6 to 4. Which phrase describes the change in the hydronium ion concentration of the solution? The answer will be either choice 2 or 4, because when the pH decreases, that means that the hydronium ion concentration increases. Choice 2 is a trick answer. The concentration will not have increased by a factor of 2. It will have in fact increased by a factor of 100 because 100 is 10 to the power of 2. The exponent is subtracted from the pH value since the hydronium ion concentration is increasing, resulting in the pH of A key is plated with nickel as shown in the diagram below. Which type of cell is represented by the diagram and what change occurs? In the diagram, electrical energy is being converted into chemical energy because the power source is a battery, signified by the positive and negative ends. Since electrical energy is being converted into chemical energy, the answer is 1 because this would be an electrolytic cell. A voltaic cell is when chemical energy is converted into electrical energy. Which equation represents a nuclear fusion reaction? Fusion is when two smaller nuclei to combine to form a larger nucleus. Fission is when a large nucleus is split into two smaller nuclei. This makes the answer 3, because two hydrogen nuclei are combined to form a helium nucleus.